10 Ways to Get Rid of Laziness You have work to do from your campus or school. You have paperwork you must finish. Or you want to get rid of the fat from your belly. What do you have to do? You all know that the best way is to do it as soon as possible. But why oh why is it so hard to start? What do you have to do to get rid of the laziness? 1. Split your work or activities into smaller tasks. When you have done so much work or tasks from early in the morning until the end of the day, you might feel exhausted and tired. Your mind and body are ready to finish the day. If you experience this, try to divide the task into smaller ones or make a schedule to finish the tasks one by one. 2. Give rewards for yourself. To keep you motivated, try to give yourself rewards every time you finish any work, even for small tasks. Slowly increase the level of work before you can give a reward to yourself. For example, every time you finish the task, you can give yourself simple rewards such as you doing something fun, like playing games or video calling your loved ones at home. You can give yourself a reward for finishing today's running miles and slowly increase the mileage so reaching 5k is the condition you must get to give yourself a reward. 3. Do the most important first. If you have so many tasks to do, try to finish the most important task first. By doing so, you can have more time to do other activities. You can also have a targeted and positive mindset. After you get up in the morning, don't open your social media or turn on the TV to see what is the good show you can choose today. What you have to do is simply do the most urgent first, like preparing paperwork or check your workout schedule, and immediately do the checklist first. 4. Avoid anything that can distract you. Maybe you have made your own target to get the job done, such as you set your time to do the job during a 5-30 to 30 minute period of time to focus on. To do your plan smoothly, you must put away anything that can distract you. Ask yourself what are the things that can distract you. Maybe you can easily be distracted by TV shows or the temptation of social media. Find anything which can be an interference and put away those things during your work period. 5. Setting your goals clearly. You can reach the end of the road or reach your target if you can clearly see them. Make clear goals about any target you want to reach such as what you want to have or achieve in the next six months or next year. You can write these goals and put them at the place you can easily see. Bring those notes before you go to bed and put those notes so you can see it first thing after you get up from bed. If those notes have been around you all day, slowly those goals will become your life and those goals will be internalized inside of you. This way you can get easily motivated. Six, find the passion that makes you keep going. Sometimes, during our process while chasing our goals, you find the hard days that can make you tired or unmotivated. If this happens to you, try to remind yourself about one thing that is your motivation. Every time you face the downside of your progress, remember the thing that makes you excited to do the job. This way you can always get motivated. 7. Keep questioning yourself. To keep motivated and your passion towards your goals, ask some questions for yourself. How will my life be if I'm going through this pattern? What possibilities can happen in my life five years after now if I'm keeping up this habit? Make a simple but effective question to make your motivation stay. Questioning yourself doesn't mean you doubting yourself. Consider it as a sign to guide your path to keep improving. 8. Stop beating yourself up and start to be kind to yourself. The most common thing when somebody loses their motivation is they negatively talk to themselves. They believe that by beating yourself up, it can boost the motivation level. Well, sometimes it works, but on another day, if you keep doing this, you can put yourself into self-bullying. In the long term, it can lead to decreased motivation levels, even lower than before. Give yourself a pat on the back. Be your own spectator. Be nice to yourself. 9. Smart work rather than hard work. We all already know one recipe to reach the success level we desire is to do hard work. But is the hard work actually enough? Why don't you try other methods? Set your target and goals and do your work in a smarter way. There's nothing wrong with hard work, but hard work only can drain your energy without any guarantee of success. Work smarter than work harder. Try to find a better route to your workplace find a better method to finish more tasks within one hour. 
Use your imagination and creativity to find a better way to complete your work. 10. Simply force yourself. After all the motivation, training, reading, writing targets and goals, questioning and cheering yourself up you have done, but you still don't find those things able to make you move, then maybe there's no other way. You must force yourself to move, to get up, to stand up, walk and run. Forcing yourself doesn't mean you beat yourself or do negative self-talk. You only need to concentrate the energy and move. Maybe it's not a fun thing, but if you can do this, at least you can reach better results than before. You will be proud of yourself for beating those motivation barriers yesterday. Laziness is a normal thing that can happen to all people in this world, including you. When you feel lazy to do any work or task, try to do some of those listed above. Different people may need different methods, which bring different impacts. Try to find the best way to get rid of your laziness. Let's fight the laziness and see you at the top.